Hello again and welcome back to more Ruby Jade. It's Sunday day 56. Where am I again? Oh right, the exhibition matches and oh Bella. I gotta wait I gotta I got that. Oh boy. The bullet is landing. Alright, it begins. Are you nervous, Mark? Just a bit. We're not exactly master conversationalists, are we? But we're supposed to get some answers out of her. All else fails, we can depend on Evelyn. Considering how the amount of aura she's, uh, she'd need, I prefer not to. We won't be able to... Uh, uh, for a show or... Alright. Actually, that is a good point. Couldn't they just get... <laughs> if they need info, couldn't they just get Evelyn to use her semblance and then, boom, know everything about the person? And again, don't know how much it drains her. Then we'll just have to be exceptionally successful. <laughs> Big brother! Hey, Bella, welcome to be... Ken. Beacon. <laughs> okay, I still don't know the whole story behind Bella. Or any of that stuff. I've missed you so much. Have you missed me too? Aw, your little sister is so cute, Mark. <laughs> um... Of course I am. Who are you? My name is Penny. I'm going to be Mark's partner in this exhibition match. Oh. Well, make sure to protect him and make him look good and you'll be one of my bridesmaids. Um. Bella, we're going to have to have a little talk. That's my prime directive as, for, as of now. Penny, I get we're supposed to draw her into a false sense of... Se false sense of security and whatnot, but... Don't encourage her that much. The first exhibition match is going to start shortly. In the first and second year arena, I repeat. Oh! Is that our fight? Is that your fight, big brother? No, the two on two is later. First is going to be a one on one duel. Oh! Oh, Jack versus Weiss. I remember how that goes, actually. Oh, I see. That means we can spend some more time together. Uh, yeah, that's the idea. And in five, in five minutes in, I'm already dreading the rest of this morning. I don't blame you. Ah, it's a bit hot. Are you nervous? No, just something on my mind. I was trying to put it aside for the time being. That's good. I expect nothing but 100% from you. Yeah, about that. Weiss, don't take this the wrong way, but I think you should give up. You're serious. It's not because I think you're weak. I've seen you doing training. It's just that... It's kind of a small battlefield coupled with my semblance, and your fighting style makes this heavily... Skewered match in my favor. And my summons doesn't have a power dial. It's pretty much set to <laughs> incinerate. Yeah, you're watching. If you don't know it already, you're going to find out what Jack's semblance is. Well, all the more reason for me to fight as long as possible. Weiss. I'm not always going to be able to choose my engagements. As a huntress, it's better to... Yeah, it's better if I take on such circumstances where I'm in a relatively uh, safe environment than uh, out in the world, no? So again, don't hold back. I want to fight... Oh, that's how I'm going to name? No, I want to fight Jack at her best. Then I will. Sorry, I didn't mean to insult you. And um, please keep my middle name to yourself. Only if you win. Alright, that's the stakes. If Jack wins, Weiss has to keep her middle name to herself. If Weiss wins, I don't know. Place your bets. Place your bets. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, who managed to get inside of those looking uh, the, through this network, welcome to the first exhibition match. Bring you live commentary from the first and second year arena. It's me, Professor Peach, and my... 
So, okay, that would. Co-host, Professor Goodwitch. Ahem, hello. Can't believe she wrote me into this. We'll be keeping you entertained with commentary and juicy tidbits about our students as a... As the fights take place. Speaking of which, I think our first two contestants are making their entry. Please give a big hand for Jack B. Ivory and Weiss Schnee. Go Weiss, kick a butt! Hey Ruby, everyone. D-Man! Uh, came to watch your leader lose. Yang, that's not very nice. How are you, Mark? Penny? And, um, two goals, I don't know. Are there friends of ours from Vale? Please meet Bella and... Bella, I don't think you introduced us to your friend. Yeah, he was very rude. But you're right, I didn't. Yeah, who cares? <laughs> oh, who cares? Bella! My name is Bella. Nice to meet you all. I suggest we find a better spot for spectating. Mm, she's not wrong. Let me take care of that. Hey, make way! Contestant's teammates coming through. Hey, leave the best spots for me and my big brother. Big brother? It's a long story. Let's just get our spots. Um, okay. You're not going? I could say the same thing to you. Bella didn't really pay any attention when Howard uh, debriefed us on your team. You're admitting to your association with him? That our association... Uh, uh, we'll come up with given a moment. Our leader will allow Bella to come here. I'm here to make sure Bella comes back home afterwards. <clears throat> That's why I'm keeping a distance from her. I suggest your other teammate... I suspect your teammate is watching us this very moment. That's kind of the reason why I'm hanging back here as well. I want to make sure you won't uh, try to abscond with my whatever. That's beyond my capabilities in this situation. Rest assured, we did not come here to take him from you. Not today. Even if you did, I would stop you myself. So, why don't we try and enjoy the match? Jack is fighting. I don't enjoy meaningless bloodshed, but it should. I should probably keep a close eye on Bella than you in this situation. Oh, Mark said something similar. The audience is hot enough, the seats are filled! Why don't you start us off, Professor Goodwitch? If I must. Contestants, tournament rules. You fight until someone is incapacitated or their aura is in the red. And begin! Place your bets, folks! Place your bets! This is it, then. The first move is yours. Are you really sure about that, Weiss? Uh, we can't have me ending the match with a uh, knockout in one move, can we? That'd make it a terrible showing. <sighs> so be it. Don't say I didn't warn you, though. Oh, here it comes. Dragon Ball screaming, I guess. Oh my bunny, she's using her semblance already? Oh really? Is that bad for Weiss? It may be bad for us. I don't know if we're far enough from Jack. So it's a uh, AoE semblance? I don't think I've seen one of those before. Oh, I like that expression. Yes, it is. Still, it's been a couple years since I last saw it. She should have gotten better at controlling it. This shall be an interesting match, then. Um, that's fine all of them, but that kind of was my seat. I would not give two shits. I guess. That girl is... Is something to matter, Bella? Oh, um, no, big brother, it's nothing. Nothing at all. Uh, 
That is a cool shot. Two minutes, Weiss. An impressive aura. And what's this about minutes? That's how long this match will last. Oh, a bold proclamation for, from Miss Ivory. Is there any credit to it, Miss Goodwitch? Miss Ivory always scores in the top percentage of my classes, but so does Miss Schnee. To be honest, I've never seen the former use her semblance. So at this point, it's an unknown variable. Well, I've started a countdown, just in case. Although, hmm. Why is she not moving? You do not want her to move right now. Especially close or close to any, anything living. Yeah. The air. Beg your pardon? Pay attention to the air around Jack's position. Are you going to move at all? No, and neither should you. Huh? Cute. We'll consider this your first move then. My turn. Why snow? My, my dress. Uh, uh, ice. Part of machine's gown has turned to ice. Did Miss Ivory do something? No, she didn't move at all. But still, Miss Shee's uh, garments turned to ice. Oh. This is the power of, is this power of Jack's semblance? You're getting too much into this. Ruby, you sure she didn't do anything? If she did, then she was faster than me and the naked eye. And my eyes as well. Not that they're special in any way. <laughs> God damn it. Is, is that close? Is that ice by something closer to Jack? If she tries to get close, she will die, or possibly be permanently made. Also, <laughs> is it just me or is the air getting colder? Getting colder? Of all the atomic dust chambers, Weiss use ranged attacks! I figured that out when John screamed at me, thank you very much. You won't lie. One minute, Weiss. I can count, thank you very much. And um, I'm not without ranged options. Isn't your weapon a rapier? That is much, much more. I can never pronounce the name of Weiss's sword. Okay, game. I told you many times not to do that. Okay. Oh, I can't. I can go back! Alright. Yeah, so we're swinging the sword machine, I'll launch the volley of ice. That, which stop in midair from Miss Ivory. It's this bill. Game! Stop it! His face before landing. Now uh, falling, uh. Oh, let's see to the ground. But they were already ice. Why did they stop? Because a semblance was simply turning things to ice. Well, now I know why they uh, made you the leader. You already got it. I think so. But it's just because I'm reading something similar in a comic. Comic, book, school, who cares? You got a fine brain there. Can someone explain what's going on? Maybe later. The two minutes are almost up. I didn't know you could do that. Of all the good it did, ice dust is useless, isn't it? You know, I wish we could have fought somewhere else. This has been way too short. Excuse me? Two minutes, Weiss. That shot. How? What just happened? Okay. I'm gonna do a little, little something just to 
help with editing. It's just so I can go back and get a screenshot of this for the thumbnail. Seven. First she was there. Next thing we know, Ivory is in Mishni's garden, fit, and a fist in her gut. Why? I, I couldn't even see her. You're strong, Weiss. But such a small empty arena, this couldn't end any other way. And with a first class punch, ticket to the nearest wall. Mishni's aura is in the red. This match is over. What an A sport fans. What a revolution. Okay. On one hand, I like Jack. She's on my team. It's cool that she won. On the other hand, why can't Weiss win a 1v1 fight? <sighs> Professor Peach, Miss has passed out. She may have a concussion. I know, isn't that awesome? Not well, really. Phew, well that was intense. More like awesome. You can actually control it now? The size, not the potency, sadly. Jack, your semblance is absolutely amazing. Such mastery of the laws of physics. You already figured it out? It took me years to do it. Only 35% of it. And she wasn't the only one. I think people should uh, really keep an eye on that Jean guy. Yeah, they should. Hey, no sulky faces at the... This victory celebration? Partner, what's wrong? I still don't like the idea of being a show, but I just realized something watching this fight. It's nothing. Let's go. Did we say something wrong? I think I know what's up. Give me two minutes alone with him. Uh, how can you know when I don't? Uh, because you're not looking at him. You're looking at him differently than me, Carrots. You don't think he's angry at Jack because of how the match ended? Nah, he looked more frustrated than anything. Ah, uh, that's a good temperature. You're not following him around? That girl is Big Brother's partner, isn't she? I would told you as much. I wasn't listening. So I guess Big Brother would be sad if I made her go boom. I would think so. I really, really want to make her go boom. Don't you fucking dare, Bella. What about her? Her semblance is potentially lethal, but she knows that better than anyone. Hey, it's Cinder! It's not easy making someone like that misstep. Uh, we better off with a uh, someone. Who, we're better off with someone, someone who isn't inherently lethal. The right set of circumstances, right? The right set of circumstances. And anyway, we still have two more matches to observe today. Let us enjoy ourselves a little more. You never know what surprises may lie in wait. Yes, ma'am. Emerald, we're in public. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, we're not in anyone's earshot, but you can call me Cinder when we're not alone. Yes, of course. Cinder's here! I thought you were against violence. Howard would tell you otherwise. That he would! So, this is not about how the fight ended? I'm not against fighting each other for sport, I just don't like the idea of doing it for an audience. Weiss knew that could have happened, but uh, she's not a bit. There, nah, she's not a baby. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it's about you then. About me still not being enough to par with any of you? I'm only going to show, uh, slow Penny down in the next fight. I mean, I knew that already, but. Seeing you whip the floor with Weiss, or wipe the floor with Weiss, uh, kind of 
hit me at home, you know? The difference in our strength. Which is perfectly understandable, though. No? You're getting better fast, Mark, but you can't get as strong as me overnight. I know, I know. I just wish I could do something more than heal Penny in the next fight. Well, if you really want to, I'm sure you will be able to. Excuse me? I'm talking with the same person who didn't run away from an enemy that turned into a Grim and suicide bombed him to win, am I not? Um, yes. Does that sound like the kind of person that would let someone like... Would like something like, I'm smaller, weaker, and slower, stop him? Hmm. When you pull it like that, no it doesn't. I know, I don't know how, but if Penny is, uh... But if helping Penny is what you want to do in the next fight, I have no doubt you'll be able to, Mark. So, you're cool? But, oh, sorry, you're so cool. Excuse me? Well, literally, did you see our semblance? You are seriously cool person. I'm not. R2. Partner. Now you're going to tell me there aren't a lot of people... People who call you cool? Last person to ever call me cool was my little sister. And she was a toddler. You do say children are more... They do say children are more honest than adults. I'm more inclined to trust their judgement. Aww. Seriously, how can you say things like that out loud with a straight face? The same way I didn't let my birth bother me. I just do what I feel is right. I wish more... I was more like you in that regard. And I wish I was more like you and others. So are even? Nah. We're partners. True. I really like these two. Oh, and there are events where you could go on a date with Jack, Evelyn, or Penny. So, I'm definitely going to be sure to do that. I wish you get back to the others. Uh, they've got... You've got a fight in an hour, remember? Almost forgot. Almost. Hey guys, Goku here. You are watching Your Only Mate. And Your Only Mate is only good for the fact that at least he won't eat as much of your food. Catch you later!